As technicians, we have to learn every new technology that emerges at a breakneck speed. New fuel delivery system? Go figure it out. New adaptive safety system? Learn it. And by the way, let's go ahead and change the propulsion system on the cars now too. In an effort to go green and cut down on the usage of gasoline engines, the car industry has flipped independent repair shops. But you're probably asking yourself, will EVs last? The reality for technicians is that whether EVs dominate the market or not, there are plenty of them on the road, and the owners of those vehicles are looking for techs like you who can keep them on the road for years to come. Even if you're reluctant to service these vehicles, you know more than you think you do. While our foundational automotive knowledge remains valuable, we must build upon it to effectively diagnose and repair EVs and every other new system that is introduced. We've done it before, and we can do it again. Developing these skills requires a commitment to continuous learning. We must be prepared to attend training sessions, pursue certifications, and stay updated on the latest EV technologies. To effectively work on electric vehicles, we must first familiarize ourselves with their unique components and systems. I strongly recommend that all technicians working on EVs complete comprehensive safety training courses. These courses should cover not only the theoretical aspects of EV safety, but also provide hands-on practice in a controlled environment. Many of the training providers you use to stay current, such as ASE and technical schools, offer EV training classes as do many of your trusted tool and equipment vendors. A quick search on the internet will reveal a ton of options in your area. And of course, we have covered many topics regarding EVs here in the Benpack Garage Studio. Remember, when it comes to high voltage systems, there's no room for shortcuts or guesswork. Once you've received your hands-on training and experience, consider adding the ASE EV certifications to your portfolio as well. The ASE XEV High Voltage Electrical Safety Certifications were developed to serve as a guide, sharing existing industry standards, concepts, and practices followed by individuals working in the industry. To effectively service electric vehicles, we need to equip our shops with specialized tools and equipment. While some of your existing tools will still be useful, there are several new items that are essential for EV repair and maintenance. You will need some new personal protective equipment, such as insulated gloves, face shields, and other safety gear. Also, you will need high voltage safety tools, such as insulated hand tools, voltage detectors, and lockout tagout kits. Thankfully, your shop should pick up the tab on this specialized equipment. The shop will need to make sure its lifts have sufficient rated capacity to accommodate heavy EVs, as well as the reach to access the OEM recommended lifting points. Investing in a battery lift table will protect your back when it comes to lifting and lowering hefty high voltage battery packs or other under vehicle components on ICE vehicles like transmissions. It is also essential to update your charging infrastructure by installing level two or DC fast chargers for testing and charging. And it's also important to know how to react in case of electrical accidents or battery fires with the appropriate safety gear and shop equipment. Purchasing this equipment might seem costly at first, but I assure you it's a worthwhile investment. Not only does it enable you to provide a wider range of services, but it also demonstrates to your customers that you're serious about EV maintenance and service. This can help you build trust and establish yourselves as the go-to experts in the EV service market. Remember, the key to thriving in this changing landscape is adaptability. We must be willing to learn, to challenge our existing knowledge, 
and to embrace new ways of thinking about vehicles and their maintenance. And you can be assured that Ben Pack will be there for you along the way, providing the equipment you need to service EVs alongside traditional internal combustion engine vehicles. I'm Eric Garba, coming to you from the Ben Pack EV Garage Studio at Babcox Media. Thanks for watching.